let's see what happens when we have a compound gear ratio. In this case here, we have a 12 tooth gear driving a 36 tooth gear, and on the same shaft, there is another 12 tooth gear, which will in turn drive the output 36 tooth gear. As we turn the 12 tooth gear one complete revolution, notice our driven 36 tooth gear has traveled one third the way around, but our output gear has only traveled one ninth the distance around. This giving us a gear ratio of 9 to 1 because the driving gear needs to go around 9 times before the driven gear goes around once. With the 9 to 1 gear ratio, this compound gear setup means that the output is only moving at one-ninth the speed of the input. So there are nine times the amount of torque being applied to the output shaft as there is to the input shaft of the motor. Compound gear ratio. The output shaft is spinning nine times speed of the input shaft. Although this greatly increases the speed of the output shaft, the torque applied to that shaft is only one ninth the amount of torque that's being supplied by the motor at the driving shaft. 